Hey everybody, welcome to another YDF Live Show. My name is Stephen Aitchison, creator of YourDigitalFormula.com, a program to help you become the influencer that you are. So I thought we'd just come on today and just shoot the breeze. Let's chat about anything you want to talk about, anything you want to ask me about my business, about what we're up to. The best kind of live shows that I do is when I'm kind of interacting with you and if you've got any questions about anything. So a couple of things that we have been doing. Do you know about the Messenger Masterclass? There's a, a lot of you in that already, which is good. That was a, a really good success. And as I said, we built, myself and Maria, we created that program within a week. We had the idea from idea, kind of thought to kind of actually finishing the product. Um, it was done within a week. Um, I think it was eight days in total from idea to the actual finished product. Um, and I think it's a really good program as well. So now we're going to be working on YDF program for coaches. It's going to be the core program. And we'll upsell the Messenger Masterclass and the Brilliant Facebook Live system and the Viral Niche system as well. We'll upsell that. We're going to be um, working on Arizona, YDF Arizona. So if you want to know about coming to meet myself, Maria and Lauren Jono, um, we're going to give a, a full day's talk in Arizona. And I'm really looking forward to that. Um, so we're going to do, be doing the marketing for that. We've not really pushed it because we had other things on the go as well. So that'll be coming up soon as well. That's in October, October the 17th. And then you've got a discounted ticket for the growth event as well. We're going to be attending the growth event as well. Really, really looking forward to that. It's going to be brilliant. And there's a lot of good speakers at the growth event as well. Um, so we can give you links to their page as well. Uh, so we've got a couple of more people coming in. Who else have we got coming in? Gene Flanagan, welcome to you. Rick is in the house as well. Um, we have Magella Carney, uh, Lara Richens, Cory Marais is in, Doris is in, Pantalaresco, Pantalaresco, is that right? Uh, Trisha Durano, Jen Atkinson, good morning to you. Jen, I saw something this morning um, that I was going to send you over a message about. I thought it was a really good idea. Um, Jen Bean is in, Margarita. We've got Melissa Crispell is in the house as well. Welcome to you, Melissa. Um, good to see you here. And we also have got Sak Sham is in the house as well. Yeah, so if you have any, any questions about what we're up to with YDF, what I'm up to in the business, about any kind of personal questions, anything at all, I just thought we'd just kind of shoot the breeze today. Um, it's just dead relaxed, dead chilled and laid out. Um, laid back, not laid out, laid back. Um, yeah, so that's, that's the kind of format today. It's just us chatting. Because um, I like these when it's more interactive and it's not just me talking and giving you kind of, um, not lecture, but a kind of talk on a specific topic. Um, Jen Atkinson, is an, oh yes, please send me good ideas. Thank you. Yes, yeah, so it was a good idea. I'll tell you what it is just now, Jen. So you're doing the yoga thing just now and I was looking at um, ClickBank pages um, just to get ideas for how to set up the affiliate kind of area because I'm looking at the affiliate page for YDF members as well, um, how to make that much better. And things are going to be changing in Kajabi for the affiliate um, the affiliates as well. So we're waiting on all the changes coming. And then we're going to get a kick arse kind of affiliate page for all the YDF tribe members. And when I was looking at it, just to see how to structure the, the kind of affiliate page, I came across a yoga thing. But, and this is what I was talking about two weeks ago, if you niche down in the yoga thing, like yoga for... Um, kind of losing belly fat and this is the one that I've seen and it's doing really well on Clickbank and I thought that'd be a good idea for Jen if she niched down to specific topics so it could be yoga for losing belly fat yoga for getting a, a great butt for example I don't know great glutes or a great butt or something like that or yoga for losing weight or yoga for meditation or the kind of science behind yoga just kind of niche it down even further rather than just a general yoga program. I thought that might be good and you could create separate programs for that. So I thought I'd better write to Jen and just give her my idea before I forget about it. So that was the idea, Jen, just um, kind of niche down within the yoga and create separate pro programs. And that is good for, if you have a, a, a kind of yoga program for everybody, so it's incorporating everything and you say it's good for clearing the mind, it's good for losing weight, it's good for keeping fit, it's good for this, it's good for that. If you And you could sell that program, say, for $97 if it's an online program. But if you have a, a program, Yoga for Losing Belly Fat, you could sell that for $97. It's less work 
for you to do. And then you had a program for yoga for keeping fit, for example. Sell that for $97 dollars. And, and still have that tribe and build up that tribe and that following round about you as well. So that was my idea. That's what I was going to tell you. Um, I was going to write to you about and just say that's a good idea. But it's a good idea for everyone to do that. Um, so like the positive life affirmations, for example, that I've got. It's not just about positive life affirmations. It's specific areas. Positive life affirmations for losing weight, for the law of attraction, for making more money in your life, for um, attracting more money in your life for being more positive, for being more confident, for being good with women, for being good with guys, or having confidence with guys. Um, so you niche it down kind of even further, but you're still on the kind of main topic of kind of positive affirmations. Um, and that's what I've done with positive life affirmations, and it's kind of worked. And you could package it all up as well and have a full package where it's good. you're talking about losing the belly fat, get, getting a great butt, um, for example, um, meditating, science of it and stuff like that. You could package it up as one package and then sell it separate packages as well. Um, I hope that makes sense, Jen. Uh, I'll just see if there's any more. Jen Atkinson. Hmm, I like it. Now I need to clone myself to, so that I can work in all these at the same time. Ah, just kidding. This is a great idea. Thanks, Stephen. Yeah, that was going to be the idea, Jen. I was just going to send it over to you. Um, <clears throat> and just see kind of what you thought. It's just an idea to think about. Because I think if you niche it down, you're going to get a specific group of people looking for something specific. And so the more specific you are, the better it is for your business. So this is what we're doing with YDF. We're making it more specific to coaches. Although we're saying under the umbrella of coaches, um, you could be a healer, a speaker, a writer, an author, um, a coach or an entrepreneur. So that's what we term as a coach, so, but we're still making it more specific to coaches as well. Um, Jen saying thanks for thinking of me. Yeah, it's just when I seen the yoga, I thought, oh, that'd be a good idea for Jen. I need to write to her and tell her. Um, okay, so just see if there's any more. So today is just, we're just chatting. We're just talking about anything, anything that comes up. If you want to ask me a personal question about my business or anything at all, I'm just kind of open. I'm a, I wear my heart on my sleeve and I'll just tell you anything. And I'll just be honest as well. Hey, Magella Carney, blue looks good on you. Thank you very much. This is much brighter blue than you, you actually see in the video. So it's kind of like luminous blue almost. But thanks very much. Jean Flanagan, I wish I could afford the copy at the time. Unfortunately, I'm on a budget and couldn't afford it. Uh, I'm looking to start talking about chronic pain support page, as I told you before about my arthritis. Yeah, I think that's a, the perfect example of kind of niching it down. Um, Jean as well. But that's fine. You, with, with regards to the programs and not being able to afford it at the time, it's just not the right time for you just now. And that, that's, I think that's all it simply means. Because if you really, really want a program, if you really want to learn about something, you find the money. But if you can't find the money, it's fine. You can do it at a later stage when it's the right time for you. So you're not having to worry about getting into the program because because it costs $497 or the it costs $97 for the masterclass or $197, whatever it is. You don't have to worry about that while you're doing the program. So you want to come into the program when you're not worrying about those kind of things. So I totally understand, Jean. Um, I've been there before as well, so I totally get it. But it's just it just means it's not the right time, but it doesn't mean to say it's not for you. It's just not the right time for you just now. Um, we've got Lysla Bonita in the house as well. Kathy Baker's just come in and joined us. Louise Cresic Crow's joined us as well. Welcome to you. Right, um, we'll just see. So if you've got any questions about anything, we're just chatting here. Just talking about different things that come up. Um, nothing planned. We're just kind of talking. Um, Stacey Lynn Rand. Uh, good morning, Stephen. Long time no see. Been a while since I've been on Mission Monday Meditation. I'll be doing the meditation today. Over on the CYT page, I'll be doing that um, continuing with the Shaksa series. Um, so that's what I'll be doing today over on the CYT page. Howard Mann, question. For those of us who do not have an email list and with the bot coming out, do we still need to focus on building an email list? They go, <coughs> Howard, they go hand, excuse me, they go hand in hand. Um, so you build up the bot list. It's going to be easier to build up your bot list first. But within that, you could send out um, a sequence to say if you want to get a free MP3 download, or if you want to get a free ebook, um, click this link. So you've got buttons at the bottom, uh, or you've got a main menu as well. 
So within the main, I'm just going to show you what a main menu is, if I can show you it here. Uh, I'll just get up. I don't know if we'll be able to see this. Right, so I'm just going to go over and show you what a main menu is, Howard, so you can see exactly kind of what it looks like. We'll go over just now. And I'm just going to go on that. Okay, so this is um, part of the bot system here. And you can see in the bottom um, kind of right hand side, this is what I've got just now. And this is the main menu part of it. So this is always going to be there on every single kind of message that you send out. And it's got check out the website, free MP3 download, check out products. So they can click on that and they automatically go over to a sign up page. So you can have that on your main menu or you can also have it as kind of buttons here. So I'm going to show you one that's got buttons. So take me to the live show, no thanks Steve, that's something different altogether. You can send out a specific message with three, or four, um, three buttons on it at the bottom. I'll just go back down at the bottom here. Yeah, this one's just got join me live because I was looking for people to kind of come to the live show. So you can do it here as well and have three buttons down here and send them over to a free MP3 down link, a download or a, a free ebook download for example. So you can do that as well and that's a way to use the bot to build up your email list at the same time. But I would definitely still focus on your email list as well. But just now for me, I honestly think that the the bot is going to take over or messenger is going to take over from the way people communicate online is going to be in messenger because um, most people are on Facebook most people have got the messenger app and you can now download the messenger app separate as well and now you can use it as an SMS um, app as well so Facebook are kind of pushing you to use it as your main SMS app as well that's why more and more people are going to come on to this so yeah I would definitely focus on that Howard um, focus on the bot um, and then use it to build up your email list as well so I hope that makes sense. Uh, I'll just see if there's any more questions or anything here. Um, Mamta, what is the meaning of your digital formula? What it reveals? Your digital formula is a program to help you build up or grow your following on Facebook to get more leads, more sales and more reach on your page and to connect with your audience more. That's what your digital formula program is all about. It's got three sections in it. It's got the mindset section, the, the platform section, and the actual business section. So the business section tells you how you're going to make money from this, from growing your following on Facebook, for example, or growing your following online. Platform is all about kind of Facebook and how you bring um, grow your following on that. And the mindset stuff is really important. You need to know that before you can actually even start anything. So it's all about having the, developing the right mindset, the right set of beliefs, and the right principles and values to go online and start doing what you're doing as well. Um, so that's a full program of your digital formula. And under the umbrella of your digital formula, we've got other programs like Messenger Masterclass, teaching you about the Messenger bot, the brilliant Facebook Live system. And we've also got the viral niche system under the umbrella of YDF as well. So that's what um, your digital formula is all about. I hope that helps. Um, Awad is watching from the UK. Welcome to you. I'm just going to see if there's any more questions. Um, Jen Atkinson, how long did it take you from when you flipped the on switch on the initial YDF program till you felt like it was really taking off? Um, th that was a slow process, to be honest, Jen. Uh, what happened with YDF? It was just it happened by accident because I knew a lot about kind of um, Facebook and how to grow a Facebook page. People kept on asking me all the time. And I thought I'm going to make, eventually I thought I'm going to make a program and I sold it initially for about, I think it was $97 and it kept on going up as I was adding more and more to it. So when it became a success, how, how long did it take for it to take off? It's still taking off, if I'm being really honest. It's still taking off. This is where your marketing skills come in. So what happens is initially people see what you're doing um, online and so, say for example, you're doing the yoga, they'll see how it's um, benefiting you because you're doing the lives and you're, you kind of look great on the live and that as well. And people are saying, how does she look so great 
um, what she's doing to do that. And you say, well, I'm doing it through yoga. So that's how initially people are going to be attracted to you. Um, not attracted to, but attracted to your program. And then it'll just be a, um, it'll be like 10 people buy and you think, oh, that's brilliant. That's a real success. And then you start thinking about other ways to do it. And then you have to start thinking about marketing. And a lot of people think in marketing is a dirty word, but it's not. You need to do the marketing and learn about marketing as well. Marketing online, for example, on every single show that you have, have a call to action. Um, if you're going to be doing a kind of once a week show, have a call to action on every single show. Have a call to action on some of the posts that you're doing as well. Make sure you're doing one or two posts per week where people are getting a free sign up for something. They're getting a free download or a free ebook or a free video, for example. So always have a call to action. That's basic kind of marketing stuff. But a lot of people don't really know about that and don't really know how to do it. Um, so you do you, you learn about that and then it starts taking off slowly and you can see the graph going upwards and up and up and up and up and up. Sometimes it'll take a big dip and then it'll go back up as you have more ideas and um, get more creative about it. But it's still I still feel YDF has taken off. It's still if those, uh, if you think about a plane, it's just kind of running along the runway just now. And with YDF, I think it's just uh, the wheels of the plane are just kind of coming up, just now ready to take off. And uh, I still feel that about YDF. I know we've got, we've made so many hundreds of thousands of dollars with it, but I still feel it's on the, the takeoff stage and um, just now. And I think that's a good thing um, because you're always trying to think of ways, creative ways to do things. Um, so yeah, it's still taking off just now. But it took off, uh, funny enough, the, the graph would go kind of upwards um, when I raised the price and I put more um, stuff into it. Um, it's still doing that just now. So that's what happened definitely when you raise the price for some strange reason. It looks more attractive when you raise the price and I've kind of spoke to you about that as well, Jen. I hope that helps, Jen. Um, Stacey Glenn Rand, I miss your um, awesome Scotland accent. <laughs> Thanks very much. Okay, we'll just see if there's any more. And Jean Flanagan, I was researching other pages about bot programs. How can you compare your bot learning to others? I can't compare Jean, to be honest, because I don't know what other people are teaching. Uh, I would imagine they're teaching kind of similar stuff because you need to know how it works. You need to know the practicalities of it. And then there's the other side of, okay, how do you implement it once you know the practicalities of it and you know exactly how the program works? What do you do with it from there? And I guess that's what the live shows are about and I kind of give you ideas on what to do with it. I shared a, kind of an idea that I had the other day. I'll show you just now actually one of the ideas that I had and see if it's kind of taken off. I'll show you exactly what I mean. So I had this idea last week to put a post up and try and make it go viral with regards to kind of organic um, going viral and with kind of paid advertising as well. Uh, basic paid advertising, I don't mean really focus on the advertising, but this was a post I put up. So this was the idea I had. And just putting a quote up, but underneath it, you know how you get these kind of um, viral images that say type yes if you agree. This was type yes in the comments if you'd like a free MP3, love yourself. And so you can see 237,000 people were reached. And I spent $100 on that just to promote it as well. It was shared 1,400 times and there was 595 comments. And you can see a lot of them 17 minutes ago, they're still typing in yes. Yes. So they're all going to get subscribed to the bot. And that was an idea I had. And that is the difference between myself and other programs as well. They don't give you these types of ideas. They don't do this and um, give you these types of, and where, by, as I'll show you them, and I'll show you them in a video, um, and I showed in a video in the Messenger Masterclass as well, exactly how to implement the strategy, and I think is a good one. And you only need to do this once, but just promote it, learn to promote it to the right audience as well. If you can promote this, just one, you don't need to be doing it every single day. If you can promote this just to the right audience and just keep on promoting it and scaling it up, that's all you need and people are going to be subscribing to the bot that way and then they're going to get messages out about to go to the website, to go to the blog, so I can make money on the blog. 
and then they're going to get um, free MP3 download as well from this because of the, the bot messages that they're going to be getting out so they'll sign up to the email list and obviously you connect more with your email list, you connect more with people on your bot, you connect more with people on your page as well so it's all about the connections that you're making um, as well so I think that's the difference and um, for me that would be the difference but I've never seen the way other people are doing it so I can't really honestly say what the difference is and um, I've seen one program just now and for me that is a big difference I'm giving you creative ways of doing it as well and I'll have case studies in there I've just kind of written out to us a, uh, a few groups and um, for case studies as well and Jim Flanagan saying thanks good good I hope that helps um, I'll just scroll down here Jen Atkinson thanks one more question please last one I promise you can ask as many questions as you want there's no this is totally open to kind of questions and you said you raise the price as you add new things which makes sense how do you raise the price as your product grows without upsetting existing members who are paying a lower price and who are loyal customers from the start you keep the same price so anybody that comes in at a, a certain price point if you're doing a monthly program for example and say it's $37 a month and um, if you're doing that you keep it at the same price but you can still raise it then to $49 a month without um, affecting the original ones so you see them as you can call them call them out as founding members the founding members of your program so you will always get that for $37 anybody else new that's coming in it's going to be for $49 because they're new members even if you've not added to the program you just think okay this is worth more and your program is worth more then you can still raise it to $49 and keep them at that price level if you raise it in the future to $97 a month then the new people coming in will get it for $97 a month instead of the $49 or the $37 for the founding members so make your founding members special feel special as well um, we've got founding members of um, kind of the YDF tribe as well and we, we call them out on it as well we've got a lot of founding members and the way I do it I have more kind of conversation I have much more one-to-one -one contact with them and um, I've spoke to a lot of the founding members and kind of the YDF tribe via Skype and um, via the messenger one-to-one -one. Um, so we I kind of hopefully it makes them feel kind of special in that way but it's not just just strategic thinking it's because I'm truly grateful for the the original people that came into the YDF program and are still contributing like Laurie Emmett and um, like Keith Wells like um, there's a few, loads of people in there that are still coming on the live show and they're still contributing to the group as well and um, so it's about making the founding members feel special but not giving them a different price keeping at the same price all the time it's just, I just I think it's thinking about how you would like to be treated so if you're one of the first people to buy it and then suddenly somebody said to me okay we're putting the price up from 37 to 49 dollars I think I'd be a wee bit pissed off as a founding member so I would want to be treated a wee bit differently because I'm a founding member so I hope that makes sense um, Laurie Emmett uh, Lysla Bonita is saying wow that's awesome brilliant Good, good. I'm glad you like that idea. Laurie Emmett, um, what do you think about one-to-one -one coaching as a business model? Do you think group coaching be, can be just as successful? I'm trying to avoid um, falling back into trading hours for dollars model. Yep, I had with my brick and mortar businesses. It was very successful but took over my life completely. Laurie, I totally agree with you. I don't like the one-to-one -one model. And I've not got a lot of coaching clients one-to-one. -one. Um, I've got um, two at the moment and I opened up one more space just to have three but at one point I had 12 one-to-one -one coaching clients and it does take over your life I, I don't like the one-to-one -one model I like the one-to-many model like the group coaching uh, I like that much better and even better than that I like it live as well that's why we're doing YDF Arizona um, as well it's not as lucrative but for online coaching uh, one-to-many is much better so if you can get a group of 10 to 12 people and um, they've got the same kind of goals, the same kind of um, purpose that they're striving towards, then it's much better doing it that way and it's much more lucrative as well. So instead of coaching, say your coaching costs $200 for a kind of one week on Skype 
So every week they're getting together, or you're getting together with one person for two hundred dollars a month. Uh, in a group coaching setting, you can say, okay, it's ninety-seven dollars a month, and you've got twelve people doing it. So it's about twelve hundred dollars a month for you, but it's the same amount of time you're spending. Apart from doing the preparatory work and um, the preparation work that you have to do, is the same amount of time you're doing for group coaching. So it makes much more sense to do group coaching, but it's a little more tricky to kind of um, organise the group coaching and keeping the dynamics of the group together as well. So you have to be careful about the people that you choose because some people are going to be really quiet in a group. Some people are going to be very vociferous and they're just going to kind of speak out all the time and they just want to hear their own voice. So you have to manage the kind of group as well. So you could even have two separate groups. Um, groups of people that are kind of more vociferous and they're kind of putting the they've got a lot more opinion than others in another separate group. So it just depends on how you want to manage it. But from a business point of view, it makes much more sense to do group coaching. So I would definitely do that, um, Laurie, if you're thinking about that. And I think it's a good way to go. I definitely think it's a good way to go. Um, Stacey Glenn Rand, um, thank you for all your business knowledge. want to get my online business going, but I get so sidetracked. Been meditating, so get more focused. Why do you remember my goal by August? Excellent. It's a good time as well, Stacey, because we are um, putting the price down of YDF. With YDF before, you were getting everything in a whole package. You were getting the brilliant Facebook Live system. You were getting um, the viral niche system. You were getting the YDF program and the monthly. Now we're going to have a core YDF program. So it's only the core that you're getting plus the monthly kind of calls as well if you want to join in that. And that's going to be 497 and then there'll be an upsell if you want to get the Viral Niche System, the Messenger Masterclass and the Brilliant Facebook Live System as well. So we're going to make it the core program. So you're going to come in at the right time if you're doing it in August. And that's going to be a perfect timing for you. Lisa Otto is saying 1100, 111 people. Yeah, strange how that happens. It seems to be, it kind of comes down to 111 people coming on. Uh, it kind of stays there and just floats by. Uh, Maria Flynn. Group is an awesome model and I'm happy to discuss this with you um, how you go about it for Mojo if you like, Laurie. Um, that will be good if you want to speak to Maria as well about that, Laurie, um, if you're going to do that. But I think it's um, definitely the, the way to go. If you're thinking about coaching, one-to-many is much better, in my opinion, one-to-one. -one. Or the other way about it, you could have your one-to-one -one sessions at a much higher price, so it's going to be worth your while as well. So for people to get on to one-to-one -one coaching with me, it's going to be $2,000 a month. That's how much it would be for one-to-one -one coaching just now. And that's um, a Skype call every week for for however long you want it to be. So it could be three months, could be six months, could be nine months or a year. Just depends. Or you could just keep it ongoing and just have me as your business coach for $2,000 a month. Um, <coughs> but that that's good and a couple of points because uh, it kind of whittles out the people that are not really serious about the coaching and if somebody's willing to pay $2,000 a month to have me as a business coach which there are people um, willing to do that as I said we had 12 I had 12 on at a time but I just I just didn't have time for anything else so it's good for pulling out the people that are not serious about your coaching so if you lower the barrier if you lower the cost to entry for your coaching, say you're going to charge £200 a month. A lot of people can afford that, but they're not necessarily, it's not creating that pain within them um, to do the work. So they've got to take action. As you as a coach, you've got to kind of kick butt. You've got to kind of help people and be motivated as well. So for $200 a month, some people might not still be motivated. Whereas if you put your prices up to $1,000 a month, there's a pain barrier there whereby when they pay that $1,000 a month, they're going to be bloody sure that they're going to do the work to get as much as they can out of that coaching that you're giving them. So you could raise the prices for your one-to-one -one coaching as well. And um, that's another way to think about it as well, Laurie. Um, Laurie Emmett, uh, that's brilliant. Thank you. I hadn't considered the, the dynamics of different personalities. Yeah, that's a big thing to watch out for. Um, I had some things happening with that as well. Um, whereby one person was much more kind of outspoken than everybody else to the detriment of the, the rest of the group 
And that's when I learned, okay, we need to kind of think about group dynamics and the people that are coming in and have set rules as well. Um, so if you're having a group and you're just doing a round table, you could just say, okay, you're only talking for 10 minutes. Once your 10 minutes is up, I'm going to stop you and we're going to move on to the next person. Or I'm going to stop you and then the group will give you feedback for five minutes. Um, so it depends on how you've got your group coaching set up. So I'll definitely look into that, um, Laurie. I think it's a good, good business model. Um, Stacey is saying thank you so much. That's awesome. Excellent. So I hope to see you in August. Stacey, that'll be good to see you. Um, Jen Atkinson, perfect, makes sense. Brilliant, good. I just think there's a lot of scope with the yoga thing. Uh, Jen, there's a lot of areas that you can go into. Uh, Liza Bonita, Facebook is not working properly for me the past few days. It's always goes, it always go forced stop and send report. Hmm. I'll pronounce it forced stop and send report. Ah, I've not seen that before. I know Facebook is glitchy, and usually when it's glitchy, Facebook it usually means there's a change coming up, some kind of change in the feed or some kind of change that they're doing in the background. That's usually what um, what it means when Facebook goes glitchy. Vanessa and I do. Question, has the current YDF program changed for the current members, Stephen? I'm late, may have missed it. No, it's not changed at all. It's only the format that's changed. So I've given you an extra big kind of module in there. Um, and that's all about the mindset. So it's uh, the mindset section of the program. So I've changed the structure of it. So it's not like 50 videos all on one kind of page and you're scrolling down to see all the videos. It's now in three separate sections. So it's in the mindset section, platform section, business section. So you can focus on the mindset first, get that done and dealt with, then focus on the platform, then focus on the business. Um, and anything else you've got, you've got access to the other programs as well in there, Vanessa. But focus on the, the YDF core program first, and that's at the very top of your, when you log in on your members area page. So you'll see that. So it's not changed for the current members at all. It's just the structure of it has changed. And plus there's been an added um, module in there for you as well. I think that's all the questions we have. See, I, I kind of like this kind of chatting with you and just kind of talking. I know you've got questions and that and just kind of chatting and just calling people out as well. I kind of like this format. Um, so I thought that's why I'd do it today. So unless you have any questions, I think that's us. We've been talking for about 35 minutes or something. So get a question in there quick in the next 30 seconds. If you've got any questions or if you've Personal questions, business questions, anything at all. <coughs> right, what I'm going to do, I don't see any more questions. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put links up for YDF Arizona. Um, that's going to be brilliant. I can't wait to see everybody that's coming to Arizona just now. It's going to be very small and intimate, so we can work with you kind of one-on-one -on -one as well. So bring your laptops as well um, to YDF Arizona. Plus, as I said, you'll get the discounted ticket for the growth event, which is going to be amazing. Um, I'll put the link up there for you. I'll put the link up for Messenger Masterclass for those who missed it. It's now um, the full price just now, but it's still a great deal at 197 um, And we're working on the YDF page uh, as well just now. Um, so that will be coming for the end of the month, and we're going to be promoting that big time as well. Maria Flynn, wood, wood, I can't wait for Arizona. Arizona is going to be brilliant. I really can't wait for it. Um, <coughs> it's going to be amazing. And to see you in person again, Maria. I know we're at kind of Edinburgh recently. And to get to meet Lauren Jono in person as well. I spoke to her loads of times on Skype, but I uh, never actually met her uh, in person, so that's going to be good. Stacey is saying peace out. Um, Cheryl Fletcher Green, thanks, Stephen. Have a brilliant day. You have a brilliant day as well. And everybody else, have a brilliant day. I will see you on Monday. I'll be back to normal on Monday. And I will be going live more. We're going to rebrand the Grow Your Followers page because um, I've realised I've kind of neglected the Grow Your Followers page. So, Maria, if you could put a link up to the Grow Your Followers page as well or the Grow Your Followers group, um, I'm going to be doing, I'm thinking about doing a live show just like this where I'll just be chatting in the morning. I'll still be working away. Uh, I'll just be chatting because I get up anyway and I'm doing kind of work, checking Facebook messages, checking email messages. So I thought I'll just go on live in the um, Grow Your Followers group and just chat just like this, but still while whilst working away. So it'll be like a reality kind of TV thing. Well, not really, because you're not following about. It'll just be me sitting in front of the computer working away and talking to you at the same time. 
Um, yeah, so if you want to join the Grow Your Followers group, we're going to be I'm going to be going on live there more and doing a lot more with the group and rebranding it. So can't wait for that. Okay, that's it for just now. I'll put lots of links up for you and I'll see you on Monday. Have a brilliant day, have a brilliant week, have a brilliant weekend, whatever you're doing, and I'll see you on Monday. Namaste. Take care. Bye now.